Hey Christmasers, welcome back to the channel for Christmasing. Today is a very, very important day for me. In 2020, I made a Grinch tree. This one. I made it in my kids' room. I put up a little ring light and I had my phone on selfie mode and I made you my very first video. That video, um, well, it's special because it was my kids' room, but it's also special because when I started this social platform, I came to inspire. It's just the one, one thing I wanted to do. All I want to do is inspire you. And Desi Perkins and her mom, Patty Gillespie, saw my video and they made a tree for Ocean, the new baby Ocean. They made him a Grinch tree and they said my video was their inspiration. Now that, if, if I wasn't completely blown away by that, nothing, there's nothing that could blow me away. My breath was literally like, it just took my breath away because instantly, the influence of all influencers, the one that you, the one that the one that they were watching, the one that you were watching. Now you're watching me, but you you came for Desi, but you stayed for me. And Desi, Desi and her mom Patty, they are DIYers in like in like the DIY sense. Like they're like, well, why would we buy it if we can make it? And I'm like, why would I make it if I can buy it? <laughs> so we are this like beautiful little we're this beautiful little rainbow that's about to happen, and the, the pot of gold shoots out at the end because when you get a real DIYer with the Queen of Christmas, I mean, big things happen. Are you ready for this? Are you ready? Christmasers, are you ready? <gasps> oh my garland, Patty Gillespie Hi. is in my studio. This is happening right now. I, Hi everyone, I'm um, so excited. If you told me a year ago that you would be ne like next to me, that we would know each other in person, I would have never ever believed oh. you. It was, we're I'm like- I'm so happy to be we're, here. We're meant to mm -hmm. be. These we, are meant to be. Oh, definitely. I'm <laughs> so, so excited. <laughs> Patty is a DIYer, like she wears the crowns. So DIY, DIY queen, <laughs> Christmas queen. So she is going to show us how Desi's Grinch hand was made and how Patty just put that drum together real quick. That's right. <laughs> For a solid month last year, my DMs filled up with, Gina, how do you make the drum? I can't find a drum, I need to make one. And I said, I don't know, I didn't make it. You're gonna have to ask Patty and Desi. Patty made the drum. Patty, tell the Christmasers how you did it. Well, we had to do something similar to what Gina had. So we started looking around the house and we had this fabric and the box was a PR box that my daughter received with some products. And uh, uh, this was in the garage, the rope. It's like water so ski the, rope. Okay. They use water ski rope. <laughs> it's so perfect though. They to glue it. All. It is, I would so, never, have, okay, when I saw it in person, cause you, I, mm -hmm. no, I don't know if anybody got like that close up, but when I saw it at first in person, I was like, there's like, there's like water ski rope, but it looks It works. It, it works perfectly, yeah. mm -hmm. perfectly. She created, so this is, a, this is a round box. I'm gonna call it a hat box. It is a PR box. Mm -hmm. We're gonna call it a hat box. And then she used a water ski rope Mm -hmm. to tie off and she created an X pattern and she did it all the way around. She used a fur on top. That's right. And then the Grinchy fur around the top as well, just to trim it off. So you always have to have a top trim and a bottom trim. I am going to recreate uh, a version for somebody who maybe isn't as creative as you. Oh, you'll be <laughs> wonderful. You are so creative. I'm gonna re I'm gonna recreate a version for you, Christmasers. We're gonna time lapse it so you can see it. But I, I just want to point out, like you use things around the house. That's right. You said I need to you make know, something, and you I was to... looking around. We were yeah. all looking around. It's a scavenger. Okay, like you, it was a little scavenger hunt. Yeah, exactly. And I think that's when I saw this in person. I I truly am just blown away by this because. I don't, I, people don't believe that about me, but I really don't, I'm not like, I don't know how to make things like this. It wouldn't have occurred to me. And, um, and you just, you just There's uh, this feeling when you um, just go around and find the things in your house, uh, and then you create something, it's even, you feel so happy. You know, you that do, you that's why when you come to my house, you find random giant hats in the trees. I was like, well, I have a hat, I'll put it in the Christmas tree. <laughs> I can, I can like hear the Christmasers freaking out because I'm next to your drum. I'm like, I'm next to the drum and it's pink. Mm -hmm. And they're like, I love your Grinch tree, but I'm gonna add pink to mine. I'm like, I know because Desi is an influencer and because Patty, Patty made the perfect drum. And this is the drum everybody wants to achieve. Oh. When I, this is like a little sweet story, but when mm -hmm. I met Patty in person for the very first time, she came outside, she didn't know me. She came outside and you were bundling up the leaves. We did our Halloween and we did That's Halloween right. together. Uh -huh. And she was making these perfect little leave situations for me so I could put this on this big arch I was making. And she said, I don't have anything to cut the zip tie. 
And when you said that, you, one, I knew you were a Christmas star because Christmas just oh, cut the zip ties, yes. but I knew you were like my soulmate because uh, cutting the zip tie is a big deal to me. If you don't cut zip ties, well, we can't be friends. That's right. And Patty's like, I don't have anything to cut zip tie. <laughs> Instantly, I was like, she is my people. We are peoples. <laughs> it's true. That's true. The second you did that, I was like, Meh, it's meant to be. I can't even believe it. I just can't even believe it. It's your hair. I cannot even believe this. This is what was coming out of the top of the tree. Uh -huh. Seeing this in person is it intimidating to me. I'm actually intimidated seeing it in oh, person. Right. Patty, tell us how Desi did this. Well, uh, we had glue. The we did the glove. We put a stuff in here. It's a piece of it's a piece of velour, uh -huh. and it's hot, it's hot glued together. So when when you heard them complaining about how they burnt their fingertips, it's because they, they hot glue. glue they hot glued everything. It's very aggressive. <laughs> and then um, this the is hand, the top top of the drum. The, yes, the same fur the that drum. we and used you for use that, that as the tree skirt too, uh -huh. right? That's right. We made everything from. I think it was uh, like ten dollars. We bought this fabric. Couple a yard of it. Yes. Uh -huh. And look at this. <laughs> this is a we wire hanger. A wire hanger from the dry cleaners. I was I was told there was a dish glove involved, so I got one. <laughs> this is filled with batting, That's like what you stuff your pillows with. Mm -hmm. So if you don't have any, just open up a pillow you don't An like. An old pillow that so has to go. Pro tips: <laughs> serving them up. That's what we're doing. Uh, we're serving we're serving them up in the clinch hand. Just like <laughs> the pro tips. Then does he cover this with tin foil? That's right. She covered it in tin foil, sculpted it. Mm -hmm. There was hot glue involved on the tin foil. There was hot glue involved, and also before that, she put wires in each finger, you know, of the to, glove to get to, the sculpt uh, right. And which then, is really, mm -hmm. this is so authentic. This mm -hmm. literally could be the Grinch hand. Mm -hmm. And this is this is one of my favorite little details. There's little clear, like the little rubber bands you use when you do like a little, a little braid, and you just to little, hold it. The fur to contain right the here. fur mm -hmm. is like is like Grinch fur styling. <laughs> She's, a, she's, she's styling the fur. It's, this is incredible. So the wire hanger is wrapped around and then the hanger goes through the hand and then you attached it with like a paint stick. Mm -hmm. Just to hold it straight uh, on the tree. It came out just like this. Mm -hmm. It's incredible. So this is, so if you are this talented to do the DIY and you, you can accomplish this, then this is, this is amazing. I have made Christmasers. I made a little printable. <laughs> um, of a Grinch hand. It's pretty good though, right? Oh, it's uh, perfect. Yeah. It's almost the same. Yeah. <laughs> oh, almost. One is three dimensional and epic, and one is going to be two dimensional, and it's going to do a good job. So <laughs> I made a little printable, and then when you're going to use it, I thought, like, because I didn't I didn't want to get a hot glue gun burn on my hand, I was going to use it. I was going to use She's so smart. Uh, I was, I'm so lazy. <laughs> I was going to use a Christmas stocking. It's gonna work well, just right? Cut, yeah, just cut it. Okay, yes, fine. and then we're gonna place this. I'm gonna do a quick DIY for you and I'm gonna show you how I make this. But I, I, I'm like, how do I do it without burning my fingertips? I'm gonna use hot glue too. That's the perfect way to do it. When you when you remember this tree, I mean, I hope you remember me a little Please. bit. Of course. <laughs> but you're, but you're, gonna, you're gonna remember the memories. The and memories this memory are the most important. Is Ocean's first Christmas tree. It was his first Christmas. And you went in, in Desi's beautiful neutral house and you put this big wild Christmas tree up. I told her that's love. <laughs> Desi always said, uh, I think when I have a child, I will like colors. And that's what she did. Ocean made, um, I, I've only known him for a year, right? I follow him like you follow him. Um, I have gotten to meet him in person now. Uh, but he, um, I have to say his little smile and his he's hes made the whole world a lot colorful, that oh kid. Oh my God, he he's really so has. sweet. He really has, such mm -hmm. a special kid, such a special family. Um, thank you. Patty, thank you for Christmasing with me today. Oh, thank you, thank you. You're such an angel. You <laughs> came, she came like an angel to our family. We love you. You bless me. You bless me repeatedly. Christmasers, let's get to the Grinchmas. Let's get to the Grinchmas. It's gonna be a very merry season. <sighs> what on earth is she doing now? <laughs> when we talk about the Grinch tree, you always ask the same questions. Where can I get the drum? Where can I get the hat? How do I make the hand? You only wanna know, well, you only wanna know three things and those are the three things. So I've been coming up with some items that you can make on your own, some little DIYs that cost you almost nothing, but they're gonna really make a statement in your tree. So I've been collecting boxes. I keep this little stack. I'm like, don't touch those boxes because these are the special ones I've been saving for this project. <laughs> On the bottom is gonna be this box. It came from Sullivan's. It had gorgeous things in it, but now it's going to serve as decor for my Grinch tree.
tray. This box is what our dog food comes in. Charlie, we love him, we buy him great food, and this box is really well made because the food's so heavy. This is going to be included right on top of that. Next is going to be the box my phone came in. Also an excellent shape box, and so it was all about the shape. I'm like, you're not the right size. You cannot be a part of my decoration. This high efficiency light bulbs weigh, oops, weighs nothing, and that's why it's going in the tree. Are you ready for it? Just wait. That was easy. The next thing we're going to do is we can arrange them around the tree and once they're around the tree, I waited to hear them. Use a double stick tape, you can use hot glue if you're just really risky with your fingertips. And then once everything is in place, you're gonna make some bows. You can use my three simple loops, you can add two or three more if you want a bigger bow, and then make beautiful bows popping off the sides. You're gonna see what this looks like and then you're gonna remember she did that with some old boxes and some cheap gift wrap. Christmasers, I'm wildly out of my wheelhouse right now, but I am going to make you the Grinch drum. <laughs> Basic ingredient is a hat box, a round box, any box you could get. Desi used a PR box that was pink, which is why her base was pink. So I went ahead and had one of the elves, <laughs> thank you Elf Ashley, <laughs> cut glittered wrapping paper to the exact diameter and height of my drum. And all I'm going to do is, I use my staple gun, because I always, I always use my staple gun. I'm gonna wrap it around and give it a staple. It's as smooth as can be. That's it, how does that look? Does it look pretty good? Does it look good? Okay, good, okay. <laughs> Next, I'm going to go in and <laughs> pre-cut for me is this fur, faux fur. It's gonna go right on top of the drum. I mean, this is, you got, you can, if I can make this, you can make this, because I am not a DIYer. I'm gonna hit it with hot glue just to get it done quick like. I could use my staple again. And just get it around the base. Call it enough. Right on top. And we want it to tuck over the sides just a little. Just give it a little pull. Try not to burn my fingers. I need them. I need them this month. Oh, this is very pretty. We're done. <laughs> just kidding. A few more elements. The next thing I'm going to do is add in my banding. I'm gonna do it on the top and the bottom. And I'm just gonna hit the perimeter with a dot of glue about every five inches. Trying hard to not burn my hands. Okay. Now I'm gonna start at one side. Actually, where's my staples? That's where I'm gonna start. How am I doing? I feel very nervous about this right now. Like what if my draw? It's been great. It's gonna be so pretty. Wait till you see it. I can't wait to show it to you. I chose a lot of sparkle for this drum because well, I like sparkly things. I'm a descendant of fish, which explains why I drink so much. Just kidding. <laughs> did I just say that out loud? I did. <laughs> Kyle. Kyle can cut it. He's like, I'm not gonna cut that, Dina. One staple to finish it off just because I love my staple gun. That's the top band. I'm gonna go ahead and do the bottom. I'm sweating. Part of me says to quit while I'm ahead. And part of me says that if I don't do this part of the drum, Patty will be disappointed in me. So I'm going to attempt. I originally thought I would drill holes and lace this through real like, you know, Gina Askley, and then I realized once I put the wrapping paper on, I have no idea where those holes are, and that was a waste of the elves' time. But, you know, lesson learned. Now you don't have to do that. <laughs> I'm gonna start in the back. I'm gonna start it with my staple gun. I'm not gonna do the whole thing with my staple gun, but I'm definitely gonna start it with the gun because cause I, li cause I like it. And I'm gonna be a little elf aggressive about it because I don't want that to come out. Don't mess with the Christmasers. Okay, next, I'm gonna go in and I'm going to dot where I want this to end with a tiny bit of glue, a tiny bit of glue, because I love my fingertips and I guarantee you love yours too. And then I'm gonna come up 
and up and I'm gonna create a pattern that's probably not going to be perfect because I'm gonna do it really quick, but you're gonna get where I'm going with this. Now I'm just doing that because I like it. <laughs> I was like, well, why am I continuing to staple the back of the box? Because that's just how I do things. So I'm just adding a little bit of Gina in there. Okay, I have, uh, I'm happy to report I have use of nine fingers. So that's great. I don't need that one very much. It's just my wiring finger. <laughs> uh, I'm really pleased with the way this turned out. I think it looks pretty good. Um, and I finished exactly where I started all the way around. And I don't know, what did that take? Like t less than 10 minutes? Less than 10 minutes, maybe $15. If I can do it, you can do it. The Grinch hand. If you are as crafty as Desi, please try to make it her way. Hers is significantly better than this one. But if you just wanna get it done and you just are like, I don't care, then my way is gonna work for you. <laughs> There's a printable on my website. It's the Grinch hand. It has five fingers. It's perfect. You're going to tape the hand to a cardboard box, like just the flap, just cut it off. You know, the one in your garage, that one, cut it off <laughs> and tape the hand down. Once the hand's down, cut around it. You're gonna end up with a pattern that looks like this. Then you're gonna take the Green Grinchy material that's going to get all over you. You're going to trace the hand. When you cut your Grinchy material, you want to use an X-Acto knife or something sharp, sharp but not cutting. If you cut it, this green fur is gonna go everywhere and you're never gonna like me again. But if you X-Acto knife through it, the hair will be minimal and you're still gonna be annoyed with me, but you're gonna forgive me. So that's a huge pro tip and don't forget because I love you so much and I'd be so sad if you left. Next, we're gonna go in with the Grinch hands that are cut. You're gonna hit these with a minimal amount of hot glue. Why is it minimal? Because you like your fingertips. I'm gonna go in and I'm gonna hit this just enough to get the fur to stick. And up the arm just a bit. Okay. These are labeled front and back, so I don't mess this up. Oh gosh, I am a little nervous. I'm gonna place it right on top. Jeez, I got my finger for it. You're like, Gina, you're gonna get your hand. And you were right. But one hand at a time, one situation at a time. We kind of left the fingertips a little bit longer so it would look more authentic. I mean, not as authentic as Desi's, but you know what I mean. All right, I'm gonna pull this back. Kind of sculpt it a little bit. You know what? This does the job. It does the job. Does it just fine? I wish I had a little bit of gel. Ta-da! Then you would go in and do the second hand. I'll do that one faster. Then, <laughs> just go and give it a little bit of a trim. However you want those fingers. And if you see any cardboard, snip it off. It's not welcome at our Christmas party. Okay. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. As I said, if you're in a hurry, you're gonna thank me for this one. And last but not least, it's gonna go straight into the Christmas stocking. I popped two holes in, this, in the cardboard. Oh, geez, now it touched my hair. <laughs> All right. And it's gonna hang inside the tree just like that. I mean, it, it, it just took us a few minutes and it was cheap. You're welcome. <laughs> I think you're welcome. Pa -rum -pa -pum -pum. Comparison kills creativity. So let's never ever do that. I came here to inspire. You inspire me every day, Christmasers. I love seeing your trees. I love seeing your videos. I love, I love it when you share your hearts with me. You have made my heart grow three sizes. I'm gonna tuck all the DIYs into the original Grinch tree and we're gonna see all the different variations. And then I wanna see your variations. And then let's just keep this going. Um, we don't have a grinchy bone in our whole body. Thank you for Christmasing with me today.